Hey, it's Nathan from The Ticket to Travel. It's 10 to 6 in the morning. We are going to a wedding today, about five hours away, so we got a bit of a drive ahead of us. If you're ever wondering why we've never done a morning routine video, it's because it would not be very exciting because we don't enjoy mornings. A couple weeks ago, we also got asked if we could do uh, the photography for the wedding. We were not their first choice, but the other one wasn't able to come, so we'll be doing that too. That's our first time and our first Nepali wedding. We usually stop in a place like closer to Hitora, but there's construction going on all throughout that, so uh, we kept on driving so we could just get out of the construction. So we're out of the Torai, now we're on the mountain roads, and just up ahead a bit from here, the roads will even get smoother as it's a, like a, a tourist kind of route, so they keep the roads better. One thing that worries me though is like at every fuel station we passed, there was the long lineups again for like really long lineups for getting fuel, and we don't have enough to go here and back, I think. So we have some tarkari or mixed vegetables and beans, and then we have. Uh, Sel roti, which is rice flour donut fried, usually made for dipping. I don't need a mask because I am such a big strong man. Twenty-three plus nine hundred seventy equals down. Three rupees for pee. Oh, no water. Five rupees for a stool. Oh, I think it's crossed out and says ten. And uh, if you're having a map, fifteen rupees. We just got through the crazy traffic. It was brutal. It was way worse than we expected. Kind of not very fun, but we're through it now. But we gave ourselves like a two-hour window between arriving and the wedding wedding starting. So I don't know. Um, how early we're gonna be. We finally made it to our destination. It's like 45 minutes before the wedding. So we found a place with some salmine. We'll hopefully have time to quickly get ready, change, freshen up, and get ready for the wedding. As you can see, I'm all dressed up, sort of. Finished the wedding. We made it five minutes before it started. But then it didn't actually start then because others were in the same predicament as us, the roads were bad. And now it's after, we can't really leave because it's hailing out. So we're just uh, enjoying the weather. The rain and hail finally stopped last night. We got to stay with some new friends, had an awesome time at the wedding. We're just really tired. Uh, we're almost back to Hitoda. We're taking our last pit stop, having a little bite to eat before we continue on. Anyways, we've just been on the bike for so long and had a lot of sun and a lot of traffic. 
it would be good to get back home. But it was awesome. It was our first exposure to an arranged marriage. It's not part of our culture. But the thing about whether a love marriage or an arranged marriage is that if the principles behind it is based on more than just how much money somebody makes or what they look like, then it can be successful either, either way. We're confident that our friend's marriage will also be successful. We wish them well. We had a great time. It would be great to be back home. Thank you for sharing part of this journey along with us. If you liked it, give it a, a thumbs up. And remember to subscribe to out-of-the-ordinary travel and culture-related videos. Catch you next time.